The 14th Asian Games 2002 were held from September to October in Busan, South Korea. A Korean traditional medical clinic was opened in the athlete's village to care for athletes who needed post-competition treatment. The foreign athletes were not at first used to Korean traditional medicine. As they talked about the good effects of Korean traditional medicine from the beginning of the games, more and more athletes began to frequent the clinic. They were curious at first, but largely satisfied with the effects of the treatment. I think better again. I think better again. Legs only back, but I think new better. Various countries and cultures. Many kinds of medical practices exist in the world, yet Korean traditional medicine remained relatively unrecognized. Why has the world now begun to pay attention to Korean traditional medicine? One Korean traditional medicine clinic in Seoul. We met Mi Young Che, a 25-year-old office worker. She had unknown gastrointestinal trouble, skin disease, and neck aches for quite some time before finally deciding to visit a Korean traditional medicine clinic. She tried all kinds of treatment to relieve her condition in several hospitals, but couldn't find the help she needed. Her only hope was Korean traditional medicine. The results of tests showed that stress and fatigue had caused functional disorder in her internal organs. This is an affair of common occurrence in modern society. The causes of this type of ailment cannot be found easily through other medical sciences, which focus on bodily symptoms only. However, Korean traditional medicine focuses on the function of a patient's internal organs to find the causes of a disease. The fundamental principle of Korean traditional medicine is nature. Unnaturalness in body function is called a disease, and helping the body to function naturally is called treatment. Also, it finds all treatment methods and medicine from nature. Korean ancestors learned how to sort good plants from harmful plants by experience. They accumulated a store of knowledge about treatment methods based on their experience. This is not an invention of well-known medical doctors or scientists. This is a holistic treatment method that grew among ordinary people. The knowledge and experience from the use of nature, gathered over time, took shape as the root of this medicinal science. Korean traditional medicine has been developing over the 5,000 year history of Korea until today. Based on the wisdom of Korea's ancestors who cared about people's health and nature, it has been developing as a modern medical science and is not considered an old era science. As a result of this, even though Western medical science is now widespread throughout Korea, 
Korean traditional medicine is still recognized as an important medical science in Korean society today. The origin of Korean traditional medicine can be traced back some 500,000 years. The treatment methods of ancient China spread to other countries. These methods also affected Korean traditional medicine. However, Korean traditional medicine has an origin that sets it apart from Chinese natural medicine. The Hyangyak Chipsong Ban recorded treatment methods. In 1433, the medical effects of Korean plants were officially defined, and it was shown that they had been and could be successfully used as therapy. This is proof of the unique development of Korean traditional medicine. In 1613, a court doctor, Ho Jun, published Tongi Pogam which compiled the accumulated knowledge of Korean traditional medicine. This contributed much to traditional medical science. Today, Tongi Pogam is highlighted as a world-famous medical book for its scientific value and has been published in several countries. Tongi Suse Powan, published in 1901, shows more creative theory than Tongi Pogam. The Korean traditional medical doctor E. J. Ma advocated the treatment method based on one's physical constitution, which is very unique. 서양의학사하고 한의학사는 근본적으로 어떤 차이가 있냐면 서양의학사 같은 경우는 어, 어떤 새로운 이론이 나오면 그것이 그 이전에 나왔던 이론이 부정을 하는 과정을 통해서 이제 완전히 전체를 장악하고 그것이 안에 주류가 되는 그런 식으로 이제 발전해 나갔죠. 근데 한의학의 경우는 그런 식이 아니라 어, 그동안 역사 속에서 여러 가지 치료 경험이 누적돼서 하나의 종합적인 의료로 만들어졌다는 면에서 어, 과거의 이론을 무조건 배척하는 것이 아니라 포용하면서 서서히 어, 치료 경험을 축적해 나갔다. 이제 그런 면에서 한약의 역사는 어, 여러 치료 경험과 치료 이론이 축적되어 나간 역사다. 이렇게 말씀드릴 수 있습니다. 중동도보다는... The difference between Korean traditional medicine from modern medicine starts with the diagnosis. We were able to see the difference between the two medicines in the case of 29-year-old Lee Young-hoon, who was suffering from pimples on his face. He first saw a dermatologist at a regular hospital. The dermatologist, focusing on the pimples as a disease, searched for the causes on his skin. The medical conclusion was that the condition must be from his hair follicles secreting too much sebum. In other words, modern hospitals check a patient's hair follicle to see any differences with the normal follicle. That also means they look at photos underneath and above the skin to treat the patient. The Western medication defines majority of diseases as a result of virus penetration into the body. Therefore, it attempts to remove the virus that causes the disease by inputting the medication directly into the affected area. This time, we went to see a doctor at a traditional Korean medical hospital. Surprisingly, they started diagnosing him by asking him about his living habits, even though it was for a simple skin problem. Questions were continually asked about matters that he thought had nothing to do with his skin. 
They are checking his pulse to look for any disorders in the patient's internal organs. In addition, they are checking the facial skin color, tongue's color for a coating, and under the eyelids to determine his condition. In the view of traditional Korean medicine, even a regular pimple can be caused by a problem with the internal organs. The idea that a source of an illness is not from external causes, but from the internal organs, is the major difference between modern medicine and traditional Korean medicine. This doesn't mean that every problem is related to the internal organs, but that we should maintain our immune system to stay healthy. Immunity is why they examine and focus on the internal organs and its functions. The Korean traditional medication states that the cause of the disease is due to an imbalance of the body function. It therefore tries to form a balance in the whole body by finding out the organ that is relevant to the status of the skin and subsequently seeks the cause. There are large crowds in the streets. Each person has a different look, personality and health condition. Treatments of illness are also different. Even the same symptom may be from different causes. That's Sasan Constitution Medicine, theorized by E.J. Ma, who argued that, since we're born in different health conditions, treatment should be suitable for the individual. E.J. Ma, in his famous writing Tongi Suse Powan, divided our physical constitution according to physical form personality, facial features, and the condition of the internal organs into four categories. They are described as Taeyangin, Taeumin, Soyangin, Soumin, and he stated that treating a disease would be more effective by different prescriptions suitable for each individual. In a traditional Korean medical hospital, to treat according to Sasan Constitution Medicine, they start diagnosing patients by checking their physical constitutions. For accurate results, features, personality, and the condition of the internal organs should be synthetically comprehended. First, they check a patient's condition by medical consultation, inquiry. It's a necessary means to get a patient's information. The conversation is important to know a patient's living habits. The internal organ should also be examined by feeling the pulse for diagnosis. Another good way to check the condition is by tapping the abdominal region. To examine a patient's condition in detail, questionnaires should be given in order to get to know a patient's physical constitution, personality, favorite food, living habits, etc. As previously explained, Sasung Constitution Medicine collects information of physical characteristics, functions of the internal organs, and even personality to evaluate one's physical constitution. Lots of theories have been thus far argued about the classification of the human being's physical constitution. 
Of them, Sasan Constitution Medicine advantageously provides a synthetic and systematic study, and it also features the inclusive implications of the body and mind. 기존의 서양의학 같은 경우는 이제 병의 원인을 이제 균으로 보고요. 그리고 중국 의학에서는 그게 정기라는 개념으로 어, 인간의 상태가 좀더 중시되는데 저희 사상 의학에서는 거기서 한 걸음 더 나아가서 개체 특성을 굉장히 중시를 합니다. 그래서 어, 개체가 지니는 몸의 상태에 따라서 병에 발현되는 게 달라진다고 보고요. 그 개체의 특성이 어, 성격이나 이런 심리적인 것에서부터 시작해서 질병의 발생에까지 다르다고 보는데 그래서 쉽게 표현을 하면 어떤 의미에서는 개체 특신, 특성을 중시하는 어, 인, 개체 의학, individualized medicine이라고 표현을 할 수가 있고요. 또한 가지는 아까 얘기 드린 것처럼 이제 심리적인 그 특성을 중시하기 때문에 심리적인 영향에 의해서 병이 발현될 수 있다라고 봅니다. 그래서 또한 가지 특성은 mind body medicine, 즉 심신 의학이라고 표현할 수 있을 겁니다. The development of science has lengthened human longevity. However, we that are endowed with an extended lifetime are now facing a life with many diseases. Modern humans are wondering more about how to live healthier and which treatment for disease to seek. The development of Korean traditional medicine for Koreans may bring another hope. It is becoming a new hope that traditional medicine treatment could bring the possibility of some disease treatments that have not been solved by modern medical treatments. In the past, oriental medical doctors diagnosed based on their senses and experience. By looking at a patient's face and feeling the pulse beat, they diagnose the disease and practice treatment through their long experience. But these days, they use modern medical equipment and obtain more scientific results. Also, they more readily accept the usefulness of modern medical technology. First, they try to accurately diagnose the disease by using facilities commonly seen in modern hospitals. From this, they are able to predict the possibility of future medical treatment. By overcoming the mutual limits of traditional and modern medicine, the areas of fatal disease could possibly be shortened or treated substantially better. Yeah, in the modern medicine and modern medicine, 어, 주로 이제 환자의 상태, 어, 환자에 의해서 어, 스스로 자학적인 증상이 평가되지만 은 요즘에는 숫자로, 정량적으로 또 객관적으로 어, 그 검사 결과에 의해서 평가되기 때문에 아, 이것이 그 지속적으로 어, 데이터가 축적된다면 은 어, 한의학의 그 어떤 객관적인 연구 결과가 상당히 빠른 시간 내에 나올 수 있을 것으로 봅니다. 그게 하나의 장점이라고 볼수 있습니다. In Korean traditional medicine, more emphasis is placed on the use of medicinal herbs from Korea. These herbs are not artificially processed, but natural and thus reduce the risk of side effects of medical treatments. In modern days, and based on that wisdom, 
Korean traditional medicine is continually being researched and improved upon. Through a very long period of trial and experience, the effects of medicinal herbs are nowadays being proven in scientific manners. Past treatment methods were often found to be faulty. However, Korean traditional medicine is not a scientific medical treatment with only a short period of experience, but a practical treatment combined with systematic theories. As scientific evidence has often reported, Korean traditional medicine is unveiling new answers to medical mysteries every day. Finding treatment through nature has long been at the root of Korean traditional medicine. It has been shown that Korean traditional medicine is not a mystery treatment that cannot be openly accepted, but a scientific medical treatment for the whole world. Though developed in Korea, its use is not restricted to one country, nor one people. Have some tea and gain composure. If you choose the right tea for your body, it is much better for your health. A stubborn disease, the chronic headache. Let's make some tea for each of the four kinds of physical constitution. First, in the case of Taeyangin, vital energy goes up, so tea made with pine needles is good for headaches. Kalgun is good for Taeumin, which has a high temperature body constitution. So Yangin has a constitution characterized by rising heat. Tea made with mint is good for this type of person. For So Umin, which has a cold body, ginseng would help heat up the body. The process of making tea influences the taste of the tea. First, the pine needle tea can be enjoyed with a full aroma when drawn properly using enough hot water. Kalgun tea has to be boiled slowly to bring out the tea's unique taste. Pour the hot water over the mint, which has a refreshing scent once drawn properly. Sliced ginseng and water need to be boiled slowly for a long time to bring out the full flavor of the ginseng root. Tea tastes good, unlike some medicine especially traditional oriental medicine tea, hanbang cha, has a deep, rich taste. Just drinking the perfect tea for one's physical constitution once or twice a day can have a stronger effect than any other medicine. An ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure.